why why is yoga a great movement practice? Uh, well, I'm a firm believer that there is a yoga practice for everyone. Um, and I have spoken to a lot of kind of, uh, you know, friends and family and people who are a bit skeptical of that notion who say, no, 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 but, you know, but like you said almost, well, I'm, I'm really inflexible. It, you'd be surprised how many people you get saying, I couldn't possibly come to your yoga class. So I'm really inflexible. And I think that's... <laughs> <laughs> that's exactly why you should come to my yoga class yes um but then equally you get people who say oh you know i'm um they would struggle to kind of sit still with you know, maybe to engage with the meditation side of things I, I really believe that you can um customize your own yoga practice to suit yourself and for me that's kind of fundamentally what yoga is it's the practice of checking in with your body with yourself um you know daily um and seeing where you are on that given day in that given moment and and providing yourself with what you need so for me my yoga practice can look really different from day to day that maybe some days um i just want to sit and do some breath work um a bit of meditation some very gentle stretches for kind of achy bits in my body some days i might want something more dynamic or something more playful or silly um especially if i've got one or both of my kids kind of crawling all over the mats then then it takes on a different tone um, and I just really believe that uh, it's a bit like when people say they don't like reading and I say, oh, you just haven't found the right book. I, I kind of feel the same way about yoga, that they need to just find the practice that suits them and it can look completely different from anybody else's. And that's the beauty of it. Um, and I think what makes it really special and maybe different from most other exercise forms that I can think of. 